Welcome to the GigaSmart SSL Decryption Use Case Training Module. In this module, you will learn about a use case for Secure Socket Layer, or SSL, traffic. After completing this module, you should be able to Describe how SSL decryption fits into the GigaSecure Security Delivery Platform. Describe how SSL decryption works. Describe the use cases for SSL decryption. List the issues and consequences of using SSL decryption. A security delivery platform should be at the center of a network security architecture geared toward threat detection and response. Through such a platform, organizations can begin to unify their security applications, eliminating blind spots and partial coverage. In order to support such security architecture, Gigamon has deployed the industry's first security delivery platform, GigaSecure. In particular, the Gigamon GigaView H series nodes support Secure Sockets Layer, SSL decryption protocol, which is a cryptographic protocol that adds security to TCP IP communications such as web browsing and email. This module describes SSL decryption as it applies to the GigaSecure security delivery platform. GigaSecure is the best way to deploy security applications to improve their performance, reach, and return on investment. SSL decryption allows the network to peek into encrypted architecture and detect potential threats. Using the wide portfolio of GigaView H-Series nodes and access to the visibility fabric, you can configure the GigaSmart line cards or modules to carry out SSL decryption. You can then send the decrypted SSL traffic to inspection tools using GigaSmart applications for further analysis. Because of access to the visibility using the GigaSecure security platform, you only need to configure this once in the network. Encrypted traffic is obtained from the network using the same span or tap access as unencrypted traffic. Traffic may be collected at any point between client and server. However, traffic is typically collected at the server end so that all conversations are made available to the monitoring and security tools. Received traffic is forwarded to monitoring and security tools. Without the private key, this traffic is still encrypted. When the server is within the control of the network owner, the SSL private key may be exported for the server and provided to the GigaSmart SSL decryption application for use in decrypting traffic for that server. Once GigaSmart has the private key, encrypted traffic is decrypted before being forwarded to the tools for monitoring and analysis. When the server supporting an encrypted communication session is not within the control of the network owner, such as any internet destination, then a path is established from inside a secured network to an unknown destination. Traffic flowing within this path may or may not meet the policies of the network owner. To gain access to this encrypted traffic, the most common approach is to force all such traffic through an SSL proxy. The proxy may be a separate appliance or may be part of another security device, such as a firewall. For clients inside the secured network, the proxy acts as the destination for an encrypted session. On the outside, the proxy opens a second connection to the original destination. For the purposes of gaining access to this encrypted traffic stream, the proxy is the local server and a private key may be obtained from it to use for decrypting the traffic. This architecture is then treated the same as for a local server hosting encrypted sessions. Gather traffic from a span or tap close to the proxy. Note that for performance analysis purposes, the encryption-decryption process introduces latency and also changes the packet. Packet timing between input and output traffic streams may not be the same. Packet sizes between input and output packets will never match. When a network element such as a security tool has to scan data, it can spend a great deal of overhead on data decryption. We already know that when there is encrypted traffic, it must be decrypted before any security analytics can be performed. The reason is that most viruses and malware are undetectable when the traffic is encrypted. As a result, the tools are simply slowed down. Additional details can be found in the CLI, HView, GigaView FM, and GigaSecure training modules, user guides, and product data sheets. In this module, you have explored Secure Socket Layer SSL decryption. After completing this module, you should be able to describe how SSL decryption fits into the GigaSecure security delivery platform. Describe how SSL decryption works. Describe the use cases for SSL decryption. List the issues and consequences of using SSL decryption. This completes the GigaSmart SSL decryption use case training module. Thank you.